After Andrew McCabe was fired by Attorney General Jeff Sessions, CBS News has learned the one-time FBI deputy director is cooperating with the special counsel's probe into Russian meddling and possible obstruction of justice by the Trump campaign. Danielle Nottingham has the latest. Andrew McCabe isn't going away quietly after the career FBI employee was canned by Attorney General Jeff Sessions Friday. CBS News has learned that the former number two in charge of the FBI kept memos of his conversations with President Trump detailing what happened during the firing of former FBI Director James Comey. McCabe has turned those documents over to special counsel Robert Mueller, which could provide important cooperation of Comey's accounts for the obstruction of justice investigation. In a statement, the attorney general said McCabe was terminated for authorizing disclosure of sensitive information to the media and that he, quote, lacked candor, including under oath on multiple occasions. All FBI employees know that lacking candor under oath results in dismissal. Sir, I can't comment. Uh, on any conversations the director may have had with the president. McCabe was a frequent target of President Trump for his roles in the Hillary Clinton email and Russia investigations. The president tweeted Andrew McCabe fired, a great day for the hardworking men and women of the FBI. Now the president's personal lawyer said Mueller should end his Russia investigation, which he claimed was manufactured by Comey. On CBS Saturday morning, Ben Goldberger of Time magazine weighed in on the political ramifications. The firing itself, certainly the timing of the firing, McCabe's response to it, and also the president's response to it last night, ensure that the scrutiny on the special counsel's investigation is only going to intensify. McCabe was fired less than two days before his 50th birthday and scheduled retirement date, putting his full pension in jeopardy. Danielle Nottingham, CBS News.